Good afternoon guys, how are you? Today we'll be doing a makeup transformation from this girl to this Transformation galore, I tell you Over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air I'll show you all the steps I go through to be able to transform from this girl <laughs> other girl you can transform yourself all it takes is just being interested eh? i love beauty i love makeup so subscribe to my channel follow for more serious transformations every day we transformed even the teeth <laughs> i'll start off by making sure that my wig is held right on my head to do that first i'll clean up my teeth okay <laughs> Jimmy, you don't. The teeth are ready, okay? The wake up. Because we need the we need the wake up to be secure on the head. If you cut off on the ears, it becomes more secure on the head. I'll just apply got to be glue to make it lay on the head. My friends have been asking me how I put my wig or who puts my wig on the hair. Guys, I don't go anywhere to apply my wig. I just apply at home. This is how I do it. I do. I use this. Got to be glued. Get it from uh, Innovate on IG or Facebook. My blood dry to just dry it down. And then I wrap something around it. As much as it's dry, I need it to lay completely. So I'll just wrap something, like you can wrap anything, a piece of cloth around it. The kind that can't stick because it's, all, it's also glue. Eh? You wrap it around so that it can lay down completely and properly. It doesn't lift. And it can stay for even two weeks. Depending on the amount of glue you apply, of course. This black uh, piece of scarf. I comb the product so that it can spread evenly mirror is here i'm sorry in case you see that i'm facing this way clean up my unibrow starting from here so you just do this still clean them up i know they're looking like let's take my flat brush and i'll take my concealer and just reduce around it i'll take my concealer in illegal pro concealer in uh, Medium beige. Tell you each product that I'll use in this process. Play more product. Which are the good ones? Like, it always looks better than the other eye. I don't know why. and just brush them into place you do this as many times as you want for as long as you want until you get your result okay tell your sister mommy and I say my cow It. So that's it for the eyebrows. Yeah, okay. If you fake, huh? when you 
before that you change. Because he was leaning on the camera thing and now he's crying. I think it's the way you told him. But, but I was fine with you. Okay, I'm sorry, you can not see. He's crying. So there is the wick up. It's laid. I have to just put some um, some powder. I'm using Mac in NW45. It's normally my exact color. Once I put this on, I'm just using a brush from Fenty. So there, I've made it like my color, my skin color. Let's take the same wig I was wearing at the beginning, guys, and just put it on my head. And then I'll make sure that it is set up the way I want it to be set up on my head. In case you're always interested in how I wear my wig, eh? this is how I wear my wig, where I do it. Because most of my friends have been asking, like, how do I put on my wig? I can also apply on you for a price, of course. And then I can style for you, I can wash for you, I condition it, comb it. So in case you're interested in those services from me, you guys are welcome. Now so I'll just start um, putting my glue, my bonding glue. Excuse me, sorry. Bless you. Thank you. I'll just put like on the sides of the wig cup. That's where I'll put the glue. The part I won't be putting, I'll be using only got to be there. Because anyway, it's even finished. Let me try to cut the bottle. No, I'm Kenyan. How do you know I'm Kenyan? We do this. Toothpaste. <laughs> Any product that is stuck inside a bottle we don't allow that's how you know we are kenyan now i can get enough you know i can buy more next week now i can get enough at least just put glue like this Eba. The glue was enough eventually this to dry it down. I'll just try to spread it a bit more. It's well dried because it's almost disappearing. But this one is a bit uh, taking a bit of time. So what I'm gonna do right now while I'm waiting for it to dry because my face is clean, I'm just going to use my Neutrogena. The pack is so dirty. I'm even afraid of showing you. <laughs> Also um, reduces sweating. It also reduces sweating for the skin. It's well spread out in my face. While on the sides, the glue is dried down. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it um, where it's supposed. The, uh, put the wig down, the wig cap, the lace. Sorry, I'm going to apply the lace now on the head. As you guys can see. That's how I do it, and then I just put my got to be on the line that was separating uh, baby hairs and uh, and the front part of the head. To be, I spread it ac ac across this line. Eh? This will just ensure that it's more firm on the head very nicely and tightly but when it comes to putting it like um, when it comes to now um, applying when you're using the bonding glue in case you need it to last more than a week or two you need to apply more layers. Like if you expect it to stay for four weeks, you need to apply four different layers while drying it down using the blow dryer, while uh, going back with the got to be glue, if you need it to stay for longer. 
but if you need it to stay like for a week you just put that one layer the way i've done it and then you use your got to be glue you seal it down you put it down with your scarf like this one and then you let it dry down or you can use a blow dryer again to just now after that I'll just start doing my eyes while I wait it, I wait for it to dry down because there is no time to wait for it to dry down then go to the next step. I start applying my the girl pro concealer to prime the eyelid. It's in color white. Don't put too much because also cleaning it up will also take time and the payoff won't be so neat. If you want it to be neat you have to make sure that um, you just do a bit of it. The more product you use, the harder you need to clean it. Like the harder you need to work to clean it off. And even the finishing is not normally very neat if you use more product than necessary. I'll also take my blender, beauty blender, dry one, and just repeat the blending because I need it to be smooth, smooth. The smoother, the smoother the finishing, the payoff when you start applying your colors on the eyelid. Sahara palette, Juvia's, the original one, you know? You know, see how it's looking? Imekula chumbi. Then I'm also taking Jeffrey Tyson's Morphe. I start off with the color brown. Um, colors to be in a certain particular place. Eh? Make sure you use a brush that is uh, a bit firm and also small with color brown from Juvia's Palace. It's called Kenya. I'm also mixing it with the uh, High Dude from Mo Jeffrey Times Morphe. And I'll just put on the outer view of the eye. Patting, patting, patting. Anymore now, I'm just blending it in. In a V shape. Colors, in case you're wondering, from the different palettes, is because I need that brown to be strong, like intense. After the brown, I'm going to color black. Put um, black on top of the brown. So take a dense brush from Fenty. And I'm taking my black from um, Jeffrey and Smoothie. I'm only putting it inside. And I'm also parting. Like inside the brown, I'm not going to put it outside because I need the brown to like be the top color there. Black, I'll go back with the brown on top. But I'll only take the brown from Jovias. On top of the black. You have to seem so dizzy when I'm holding you. You think it takes a drift in a way. And I fucking love how it hurts. I'm orangish also surrounding the brown. For that, I'll use my Sephora brush number 17 that I bought at AliExpress. The orange, the orange I'm using is also from Juvia's. Oh. Juvia's Sahara palette. And I'll just put around it, around the brown. Where I had placed the brown. I'll use it to blend the color brown that is there. For the inner corner of the eye, I look for a very bright, uh, a bright white color. Apply here. Well, I can also take my concealer brush, the one that I used, the color white, and I'll pat, I'll pat it first on the inner side of the eye, too. And then I'm going to take a white color. the black again so I'll just put my wing liner 
I'm using a wing liner from uh, Rare Beauty. Why is one eye so hard to apply compared to the other eye? I'll just apply my lashes. Lashes I'm using are from AliExpress. The exact details like where I bought it, the shop. Just comment below. That's how I apply my glue. it change color which it's already happening it's changing to blue lashes yeah i already know like how far my lashes normally go on my eye so i don't need to like measure it out just taking this and applying this way make sure it's at the end That is how easy it is to apply lashes. Treat me compared to how the look was. See you guys here when we start doing the face. So we're back. I'll just try and dry up the the parts that I sweat. I'm using a dry surface. My wet wipes are finished. And I didn't know they were finished. Before I continue, I'll just remove this. You can see it's like glued. I'll just start doing my baby hairs. Then I'll start at the end with this argan oil styling foam because to just make the hair loose. By this time, by the time it's getting there, it's already hard. So if I also add the glue that I was talking about, the L'Oreal one. It will be hard to mold it. Okay. Remove the sweater then. Sir. If you're feeling hot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Will you cut it out? The teenage couple in the estate. Mm -hmm. Now, Kumbuka Jina. Yeah, the Indian. Yeah. He's always fit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. will, you, will you show your viewers? No. Okay. <coughs> She's done with her food. The food you can take. So I already checked like while I was running. And? Alimali a kitambo. Yeah, you can give her more. I'll give her one and don't show her. Results. Yeah. 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 Last, eh? Let me move back, you see. I molded them on my head. That's how they're looking. Um, that's how I'm coming along for that transformation. Apply my primer on the face. Just tie down my baby hairs. Sweat on my face because I'm still sweating, 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 sweating. Then I apply my primer because I, don't, I can't apply primer where there is sweat. Okay, now that I use is the pink, pink lotion, color mine lotion. So I'll just put it on a brush like this the color mine lotion, and then I'll stomp it on my face. I'm using this product in case you don't want it to damage your face because people claim that it damages the face, it edges the face. Huh? The secret is well, once you are done with your makeup or once you've gone to your function that you didn't want to sweat for, you just take your, you make sure you, you use a good cleanser, a good quality cleanser. You cleanse your face and you clean it up. When you clean up your face nicely before you sleep, and then you put your moisturizer your face won't dry off or have any effect flawless i'll let it dry down a bit while i remove this so that you can be able to put everywhere 
that is required. So that's how the, um, the baby hair has molded down. I'll just put foundation behind my hand. Using the 450G, I'm mixing it with the 440G. This is 378. It's called Maybelline or Maybelline. So I've just put the three colors behind my hand. I'll just mix them. When I put, I don't put under, under the eye because I highlight there. So I just do like this. Like I'm already cutting where my cheekbones are. I think it's a bit greenish. But let me finish and then. And then you talk. Don't comment unless you've seen the end result. Because <laughs> I know some people will start saying that's not even your color. You go, you go, you go, you go. <laughs> so that's how it normally is. I'll just put no, I won't put setting powder right setting spray right now. So I'll just take my brush and just start like stomping, stomping, stomp, stomp this brush to blend the upper side of the head because the other brush is bigger. It can damage my like even this one is already damaging my So we just stomp it, stomp it like that. For Huda Beauty is just something else. Something else. Now I'll put my concealer under my eye. 37G in tat. Good concealer. That lasts long. That dries up matte. This is one of the best ones I've seen so far. The last times. Let's take the small brush that I used from the outer side to blend, blend, blend. And you can see that it's blending like so smooth. Eh? Then now. Make sure your blend is also very smooth. Eh? Like that. I'll also use another blending spoon. I'll take my powder. I normally use the Sasha Buttercup. Take it and start using it where it's required. Yes, I am, baby. Going out. I'm going out. You feel sleepy? Football was rough on you. Yeah, but I got the trophy. I know. Congratulations, baby. Mm. We'll pray then you sleep. Oh, we want to eat something. Can you eat something? See, I made nice spaghetti yesterday. Then there is rice. What do you want? I don't know. I know. <laughs> Make sure it is very, very smooth. Now I'm just going to repeat my eye pencil because some of it came off when I was applying a foundation. You just go according to the shape of your eye. it with black opal this color and black opal I normally combine them to just give me that payoff that I'm looking for my to 
pop mix the two and then I stamp 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 you know I stomp 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 then now I go to the top of the head normally contour with um, some uh, foundation or concealer for the darker shade I only use for the lighter shade to contour and then now I go to my cheekbones to just chisel out my nose And you can see it has just done the job. Anything on your face, make sure you blend. And then now I want to highlight my, to put some color on my cheekbones. Combine the two, remove part of the rest, the pigment, and then go to my cheeks and put the rest. Can you see the color? Can you see some of the color? Thank God, my. I just make sure that now my color has come back to my original color. I know you know what I'm saying. I know sometimes you might not know, but you're gonna get it, don't worry. And my cheekbone colors, I think uh, I need a bit of blending. And now I'll take my colors from MAC and just use, uh, combine some two colors to get my exact color. In MC50 and medium golden, I'll just combine the two colors and clean up the under eyes. The brush that I'll be using, another clean brush like the other one that I bought on AliExpress, it's a Sephora, it's called Sephora. Part of it before I put it on my face because I also don't want it to be too much on my face, too much cakiness or powderiness on the face. The cheek for the cheekbones. I'll just take a darker shade and repeat the sides of my nose. Dark shades that I use on my cheekbones. In case you want to learn how to control your nose, you can learn from this video at zero cost. All you need to do is just like and subscribe. My nose is doing what it's supposed to be doing. Now I'll just set my face. Use my lipstick. My dog. Doggy. So that's how it, um, it's coming along. I'll just use something for my lips. Now, I'm doing my nude lipstick. So I'll just underline it number 03, Davis. No. Okay. That's the uh, my lower lip. I'm using Smashbox in yes, honey.
that is so so cute getting spring ones again because i think my face is still powdery and i'll put some lip gloss on my lips my lip combo now i'll just comb my hair just put some small highlighter some little highlighter on my nose So there, play. on my under eye, and now I'll just style my hair like I look fire. I look like fire. Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> My subscribers will hear you and then they'll be like, what? <laughs> Mom, come and take a photo. Come so guys, you can see how the video came out. You can see the transformation like from this. Transformation galore, I tell you. So follow the steps. You can transform yourself. All it takes is just being interested. Eh? I love beauty. I love makeup. So subscribe to my channel, follow for more serious transformations every day. We transformed even the teeth. <laughs> so subscribe if you want to see how I did this transformation and many more that will be coming on my channel. Enjoy your evening. Have a nice evening. Let me start my evening. Okay, okay guys, okay guys, okay. It's gonna be fire. Because the look is already looking like I tell ya. So that's our transformation for the day. See you next time right here. Doing different transformation looks. If you want maybe different colored hair transformations. Just comment below and tell me what you'd like us to try out in terms of transformations. Enjoy your evening. Enjoy your day. Be good guys. Thank you and God bless you. Subscribe, like, don't forget.